Hi everyone, it's Neil. I'm back at ECS Coffee. That's because I come here every day for work. And we are doing a very quick review on the new Arc Carbonator Pro, which is a new model that came out from Arc. Uh, basically, it's a fancy version of a SodaStream. SodaStream probably doesn't like us saying that, but if you know what a SodaStream is, uh, Arc has come out with some really aesthetically beautiful looking pieces that basically do the same thing. This is the uh, new, fancier version, solid, solid metal, uh, no plastic to this guy at all, and it comes with a glass bottle, which you must use with this machine. This is the bottle used with this machine. Uh, and I'm just gonna show you very quickly how it works. Came with a massive uh, book, like really, really big book. And I thought, my goodness, how much information can there be? But it's in about 20 languages, that's why. So, very quickly, you take the arc canister, we'll talk about that in a second, and you shove it right in the bottom of the machine. And you twist, like any standard-ish kind of soda maker, except you trying to do it with one hand while on camera. And there you go, you're done, you're set up, you're ready to go. Uh, you take your bottle and you fill it with water and there's gonna be a line on that bottle right there. That's gonna be where you're gonna go up to. So I'm just gonna go right behind me here, fill it up with water. Okay, now I'm gonna try and fill this without spilling. Let's see how good I can do this from on the other side with water. Uh, look at me, talented, super talented. Mm -hmm. This is good old filtered tap water from the great city of Burlington, Ontario. But you can use any water you want. Never put ingredients into water, just always use the sparkling machine for just plain water. So we get to the top. Now, if you have kids at home, they might like helping you do the next part because that's the fun part is to make the carbonation happen. So pop that over there. If I do this correctly, right in there like that. And down we go. We lock and we go until we hear a squeezy, squeezy sound. We're getting there. There we go. And release. And we now have a bottle of sparkling carbonated water. So that's it, pretty simple. Um, may not, probably, definitely not gonna fit under your counters if you have upper cabinets, so keep that in mind if you're buying this. Comes in a few colors. Um, throw this in the fridge, add in some flavoring syrup. We have about 100 varieties of Tarani. Um, actually, not 100. We do have 100 types of Tarani, but for sodas, we probably have about 40. Tarani flavoring syrups you can go in there, plus uh, any of the soda stream syrups can go, and basically any flavoring syrup if you want, or you can just have it straight up as water. Now, one thing about this machine, uh, they really don't break. So if you're getting a leak in your carbonation, you may have to replace your seal. One thing to note is that on the bottom of the machine, right here, there's extra seal. It's a black extra seal. And what you'll need to do is you'll need to take out the, uh, the carbonator from the bottom, and you'll have to get put the new one in, put the new seal on top of the actual uh, uh, carbonator, shove it in, twist it, uh, sorry, cylinder, shove it in and twist it back on for the new seal. That's how you have to do that. Uh, you can find instructions in your manual for that. That's basically the only thing that can really go wrong with these. Other than that, they're pretty straightforward and pretty easy to operate. Now, one thing, it is October, 2022. Now, you'll notice on this, it says Arc Carbonator. They have a CO2 carbonator now made with 100% renewable CO2. It's their claim to fame, uh, unlike SodaStream that just has regular CO2. Uh, if you're buying one of these in the near future, again, we're in October of 2022, in Canada anyway, there's not a lot of places you're going to be able to do the exchange on the ARC uh, carbonator. You're going to have to buy yourself a SodaStream one, which will fit, they are compatible. You'll have to buy yourself a SodaStream one to go in here to get on the exchange program. We're hoping to get a program in Canada at a later date, but Count on this as coming like a freebie the first time with the machine. Hold on to it until we do get the actual uh, ARC carbonator program in place and there's other retailers with it. But in the meantime, you'll have to buy that SodaStream canister, um, an extra one, which roughs roughly about $38 to get into that program to keep it going for now. That should change in the future, but it is early on. We just got this, so just keep that in mind when you're buying it. You'll get one to start, but you're going to have to buy another one for about 38 bucks from SodaStream to using that to get on the exchange program, which you can then exchange in various places. And that's about it for this video. If you have any questions, please ask down below and we'll get back to you. They're available in Burlington and Ancaster. We do not ship these online because of the carbonator at this point, but I uh, hope you liked the video. Any questions down below, subscribe and like. Thanks again, until next time.